Hello there, Jonathan here and welcome to Learn to Play Through. Today we're going to be unboxing the game Escape the Dark Castle, the game of atmospheric adventure. Escape the Dark Castle is produced by Themeborn and designed by Thomas Pike, Alex Crispin, and James Shelton, and it is a cooperative adventure game for one to four players. So, do you think you can escape? Well, if so, why don't you go and come on around me and we'll take a closer look at Escape the Dark Castle. Hello there, and welcome back to the unboxing of Escape the Dark Castle. Now before we get this box open to check out the components on the inside, I just need to inform you that this is not the standard edition version that we're going to be unboxing, but it is the Kickstarter exclusive version. So if we ever come across any kind of Kickstarter items, I'll go ahead and point them out to you. Now when I got the game, I was able to download the original soundtrack, which contains over 45 minutes of atmospheric music. The original soundtrack is performed by Alex Crispin, who is an experienced composer and also the co-designer and illustrator for the game. So let's go ahead and start up the original soundtrack so we can listen to it while we unbox the game. So let's get this box open and check out the components on the inside. And the first thing we got here is the rule book. And it is 12 pages long and pretty sturdy. Got some nice glossy pages and some good sized text for the size of the rule book. Got some good spacing between the paragraphs so it doesn't look like everything's all crammed onto the pages. Got some information for a solo play and an expansion here. Adventure Pack 1, Cult of the Death Knight. Excellent. We got ourselves some pencils and the main cards. We got ourselves the start card, which shows a picture of the dark castle. We got ourselves a picture and some text. And another way to show the identification is this code reads DCSE-SC01, which stands for Dark Castle Standard Edition Dash Start Card 01. So that's another way to identify cards. Then we got these black backed cards here, which are the chapter cards. Now there's 45 chapter cards that come with the standard edition, and the code in the bottom left hand corner reads DCSE-CH01, which stands for Dark Castle Standard Edition Chapter Card 01. And they contain a picture along with some text, and there's 45 of them in the standard edition. So it looks like the playability is going to be very high in this game. Then we got ourselves the Kickstarter version. So the code in the bottom left hand corner reads DCKS-CH01, which stands for Dark Castle Kickstarter Chapter Card 01. And there are eight of the cards for the Kickstarter version. So we add the 8 to the 45 here, and we have a total of 53 chapter cards, so replayability very, very high. Next we have ourselves the boss cards. So we got ourselves a door with a knocker, and it reads, Do not read until you have completed the last chapter card. So there are three of them that go with the standard edition, and the code down here reads DCSE-BC01 which stands for Dark Castle Standard Edition dash Boss Card 01. The three of them are the Demented Priestess, Terror of the Underworld, and the Dark One. Then we have two more, the Master of Darkness and the Shapeshifter, and those go with the Kickstarter version. The code here reads DCKS-BC01, which stands for Dark Castle Kickstarter dash Boss Card 01. So there we have a total of five boss cards, so that adds to the replayability. Then we got ourselves some more black backed cards, but these are now the character cards. 
So on the bottom left hand corner is the code for the character cards which reads DCSE-CR01 which stands for Dark Castle Standard Edition dash character card 01. And we've got a picture of the character and its title which is the Abbot. And there's a total of six. So there's the Cook, the Miller, the Smith, the Tailor, and the Tanner. And each of them have three abilities, which is Wisdom, Might, and Cunning. And these slash marks show how powerful they are in which ability. So as we go over to the dice, these white dice over here actually have the name of the character. So this one's for the Abbot. And you can see that there's four slash marks here for Wisdom. So there's one, two, three, and four. Might has three. So there's one, two, three, and Cunning only has one, so there's one. Now there's also a couple symbols showing a shield, so that's going to go ahead and add to their die. Now there's a total of six dice over here for the characters, because there are six character cards. So each of the characters get their own special dice. And then we have these black dice, which are the chapter dice. And since this is a six-sider and there's three symbols, there are two Wisdom, Might, and Cunning symbols on each of the dice. Then our last die here is a white die with gold on it. So this is the Golden Axe. There's Cunning. There's a Skull. So this is the Golden Axe that comes with the Kickstarter. And it correlates with one of the item cards which we'll see here pretty soon. But first, we got ourselves some scratch paper here that we use along with the pencils that we got. So it's kind of cool that companies will give you extra stuff like just paper and pencils. Then last we have ourselves the item cards. And then in the bottom left hand corner is the code DCSE-IC01 which stands for Dark Castle Standard Edition dash item card 01. And there's 35 cards that comes with the standard edition, like a partially rotten apple, a cunning concoction potion, liquid luck potion, the healing versus relic. Then at the end here we have the golden axe. And this is from the Kickstarter version, so the code here reads DCKS-IC01, which is Dark Castle Kickstarter dash item card 01. So if you ever draw an item card that's a golden axe, then you get to use the golden axe die. So pretty cool there. Well that's it. That's going to conclude the unboxing of Escape the Dark Castle. So let's go ahead and get all the components back inside the box here. And we'll get it set up right here on the desk since it does have such a small footprint. So come on and join us as we learn to play through Escape the Dark Castle.